Right, it's just a quick thing about this today. This is all I'm working on at the moment. It's like consuming me and that isn't a problem. That's a good thing. I'm loving every minute of it. Somebody commented yesterday that they wanted a video when it was finished and you will get a video when it's finished. But I just thought I would maybe do a little bit of seam work with you because mostly every seam where panels are joined has got bullion loops and yellow French knots, lemon French knots. Um, and I've got a lot of seams to join here. So why not? do a little bit of that with you. I'm just looking for an easy one and when I say easy I mean easy in terms of um, getting it in the hoop. See there's one down here but it might be difficult because of this this padded bit. Let me have a look. I mean obviously you can get a small hoop but I'm comfortable with this hoop. But anyway, you can see some of the surface now when I'm working on it. I just love it. I really love it. I can't even tell you. And it's so far removed from how my work used to be. I don't think. Stay boy. You might have to turn off and we'll get a small hoop. I'll just see what happens with this. Let me pick it up. No, I think it's going to be all right. I've just got to be careful not to push that button off there. So I'll just do a couple of bullion loops. I mean, turn off. It's so boring. Like, oh yeah, well, thanks. Watch Saturday morning. Watch you do two bullion loops and two French knots. But I've got nothing else to show you because this, like I said, is consuming everything that I do. So I'm going to do it the other way, actually. And I've got lots of things here that can get in the way, like these. So I'm going to pin them out of the way. Because... I do love a dangly thing, but they can get in the way. Oh, see, it's come out now. <gasps> That's right, make me look an idiot in front of the general public. Right. I'm going to get caught around these buttons now and see it come in. So, I can't give too much away because of the uh, class, but I. So I can't tell you what my thinking is behind what I do or whatever, but I can show you how I do a bullion knot. I do 35 wraps, so I'll get counting. Well, blow me down. Normally, if I do that in public, I get a knot in it or something. Or I can't get me thread off the needle, my wraps off the needle. When I was in France last year, this year actually, not last year, I was doing these all day um, at my stand. And could I do them properly? Just with an audience. My hands were sweaty, the, the loops wouldn't come off, I was getting a knot. These people were probably thinking, What's she doing here? She can't stitch. She's making a right pig's ear of that. And I count in a funny way as well. <laughs> I always count to 20 and then I count to 15 because I find 6, 7, 8. Easier to say than 26, 27, 28. Everyone thinks I can only count to 20. But then what I did, I don't know why, I did 20, then I did 5, and then I did 10. It's <laughs> like, Karen, what's wrong with you? So that's two. I'm just going to do one more, and then I'm going to put a couple of lemon French knots in there. So it seems, seems are my uh, hobby at the moment. Okay, 
and it does use a lot of thread, I have to say. Um, I'll go through miles and miles of this white thread. But I just don't think I could ever make anything ever again if it didn't have these loops on. Because I love them so much. So that's three loops. Are you impressed? No, I know you're not. I'm only kidding. So I'll fasten that off at the back. I'm, going to, I'm reluctant to take the thread out of this needle because this is my favourite Milner's needle of the week. And I don't want to not be able to identify it when I come to uh, where's my little scissors? Oh, where's my other ear? When I come to uh, start again on seams tonight, I don't want to think, oh, which needle was that that just loves me at the moment and doesn't let me thread knot? So let's get a bit of lemon. This is cotton abroad that I'm using, by the way, just in case you want to. You might not care. I'll tell you just in case. So it'll be a couple of French knots, and that is probably like a twentieth of this seam, if that. And if I was to count the loops that's on this cloth, I can't even begin to guess. Maybe we should have a competition. Count the loops on the cloth. You know, like, guess how many sweeties are in this jar? Guess how many loops are on this cloth? We'll have a quick look at that in a minute. So that's what I do. I know, it's nothing earth shattering, is it? But I just don't have anything else to put on my blog and I can't not do my blog or panic attack. So I'm not going to fasten that off. I'm going to bring it up there ready to do the next one. I'm going to take the needle off it though because I don't want to catch my hand on that needle and bleed on my cloth. So, I need to take that pin out as well, don't I? How many loops on this cloth? Where would you start? Right, so say along this bit here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 41 on that one. And this seam, which is quite long, they don't extend across there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, so that's 91 all the, already, and then there's all, I'm not going to count them all, don't worry, I'm not going to send you all to sleep, but there's a lot of bullion loops. And in terms of seams, I've still got to finish that one all along there. And then I've got another one somewhere that I started last night. This one. That one. In fact, I think that's it. For now. But then I've got more panels to join. So that'll be more bullion loops. I mean, along here on this little pocket. That's that little pocket with the separate puffs in. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And then there's more there, more there. So that's that pocket. Anyway, I showed you them yesterday, didn't I? But maybe it's better to show you them this way. And then there's this one. That's got a little thing inside. And then there's these ones. If I can find one. One of these was on yesterday, let me just see. I can't find it. What's going on here? There, that's like a little pocket, a half pocket. And there's a big one here. There. And that's lined with the different fabric. There's no embroidery in there. So yeah, I will do a video of this when it's finished. Um, but in the meantime, Oh, on this one here, this isn't properly finished yet. This is, this will be like that. When that panel goes on, that will be a pocket. At the minute, it's hanging down because that panel isn't on. 
so that's that one as well. And there's even a little pocket here. This is a little pocket. There. So it should really maybe be called the pocket cloth, not the happy cloth. Um, 